Well, it sounds like the exact opposite of what you should do. Use a drug found in cigarette smoke to fight lung disease. But that's just what doctors are doing by testing nicotine against a certain type of hard-to-diagnose lung problem. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez tells us how it works. That's right. You know, sarcoidosis is a lung disease that mimics other lung problems, from pneumonia to scar tissue to even lung cancer. So you would think that a nicotine patch normally used to help smokers quit isn't a great idea. Turns out it brings relief to those lung patients. Jose Serra needed a CAT scan after falling on some ice. That's when his doctor noticed a spot on his lung that he was worried could be cancer. The result was that it was no cancer. Good news. Uh, the other news was a sarcoidosis. It was the final diagnosis. Sarcoidosis is a growth of inflammatory cells, most likely triggered by inhaling things like pesticides. Left untreated, it can cause severe lung damage and even death. Unlike most lung diseases, the main symptom isn't shortness of breath, but crippling fatigue. Jose says he was drinking three energy drinks just to make it through the day. His doctor prescribed a steroid, but the side effects were harsher than the disease itself. We can't use them for very long before these side effects occur, and they can be very s severe, such as the development of diabetes or high blood pressure and complications relating to those, osteoporosis, cataracts, etc. Instead, Dr. Elliot Krauser at the Ohio State University Wexner Medical Center decided to test something that sounds counterintuitive, use nicotine patches, normally used to help people quit smoking, as a treatment for a lung disease, sarcoidosis. We're hoping that people will actually get a secondary benefit. Not only will their lung disease get better, but they'll also uh, feel more energized and uh, be able to get up and go. Results from the initial clinical trial were promising, so Dr. Krauser is now doing a larger randomized trial, exploring if nicotine patches can be a long-term solution to not only help patients feel better, but reverse the progression of the disease. Now, it's not entirely clear how nicotine works, but we now know that nicotine is an anti-inflammatory drug without the side effect of steroids. We also know that nicotine is a stimulant, causing adrenaline to be released in the body, which may account for its fatigue-fighting effects. But you don't want to use that unless you need it in sarcoidosis, because yes. it is highly addictive. Of course. Dr. Max, thanks. You bet.